uh, that in 53 notes per octave as the first real microtone of scale because it has a really special property. Um, I've called this instrument Pythagoras, and Pythagoras um, had things to say about tuning instruments, and what everybody did during those times was um, doing a circle of fists using just fists, the real fists that you get from the harmonic series. Um, the problem is, when you tune like that, um, um, you end up missing um, where it, it wraps around, and at 12, it almost, it's, you know, kind of almost hits it, um, but it misses, and you keep going around, and you have to go around another 31 octaves before you get something that's really close. Um, and in the number of steps that you have to go up to do that is 53. Um, so if you, if you stretch the interval very slightly, really imperceptibly slightly, um, then you can have 53 threads per octave. And now that we're not dealing with mechanical keys, um, that's a pretty reasonable thing to do. Um, you can play it like a fretless instrument, um, have computer rules to kind of help you snap to it so that when you play chords, um, the chords lock and they sound tight because they're in perfect ratios. Um, that's, that's something that will be allowed now. Um, so, 53 tet. You see these 53 lines going across? That isn't because I got some code in there that says draw 53 lines. What I'm doing is start from this and I draw it in every octave where I have a line going up four thirds, going down the inverse of four thirds, which is three fourths, right? And then three halves, two thirds, right? So this is the fifth, you know of uh, three halves, four thirds, five fourths, six fifths. You see the pattern, you know, n plus one over n, three squared. I mean, I mean, I mean, three, three halves, four thirds, five fourths, yeah. And I, and I kind of stop um, where I did because I noticed that the only intervals that really matter are the four thirds. Um, and because it's drawn in every octave, um, you can see that you get these 53 lines. Um, they're almost completely evenly spaced. The screen is an octave wide. Um, so I snap to 53 notes per octave, but it's so close that um, it looks like the harmonic series is 53 tet, but it's pretty close to the pixel. some intervals that are 
considered to be completely useless in 12 tone system or somewhat usable here. Um, just show you real quick before it turns off diminish fifth. note choices um, they can sound better I mean you do have to pick the right interval um, and you have more to choose from so there's more to get wrong but um, definitely the, the third sound better um, you know major or minor than in a power chord they're excellent That's a result of every single note on here basically being made of octaves and fifths. Um, you're just kind of navigating a bunch of fifths up and then you navigate a bunch of octaves down to bring it down into the same range. So, I got a friend who's going to be making a de more detailed video on microtonality. Just kind of wanted to get the word out that um, Pythagoras definitely has Pythagorean tuning of sorts. I've had some people ask questions about whether Pythagoras would have Pythagorean tuning. 53 Tet is um, an extended version of it. Um, just real quick, what that means is you, you like if you had a piano, you would tune it to just fifths. You would start out at some note and you would spread out. Um, you, 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 once you got a spread of five keys, you got a pentatonic, you spread out the seven, you got the seven note system. And if you spread out some more, you got some sharps and you spread out some more in the other direction, you got some flats. In the 12 tone system, the sharps and flats are the exact same thing because they've messed with it to make them match. Um, but in a Pythagorean tuning, um, you would have a keyboard with 17 keys because the sharps and flats would be duplicated because they're not identical. Um, so, just uh, more to come. Um, with, with 53 frets per octave, which is basically an extended Pythagorean tuning. So it's a very close.